Oh look, dirty. These are going to be the tops. There's a hole to go in for the springing mechanism to go through. Nice. Right, so they're, they're all the same now. Right, so I've got these plates in. I've deburned them. I've got rid of all the black I can off them. Uh, I've got one set up here. It's flush with the end, which I've just used this parallel to make sure that it's all, all flush on that edge. And then I'll get my edge finder and I'll come off that edge and then we'll come off the back of the jaw because we want a hole 12 mil from this end and 12 mil from this front edge. set up the uh, keyless chuck and I've just got a centre drill in it and I'll, I'll get the first one done so we'll be 17.5 from the back edge of the plate and 12.5 from this edge here and that's where we want the centre of the hole so we'll move that over 12.5 lock the table we don't want the table to move at all because we're gonna everyone's gonna be the same so we're gonna work off this edge and just need to move the uh, parallel back a little bit Beautiful. Although I think I've just used the eight, not a nine. Ah, balls. That's better. These are now done. I've deburred the holes, giving them a quick clean again. So these are going to be welded on the top of this bracket like so but first we have to square these ends off because I want them square I've already put them in the saw and cut off a substantial amount because there was just too much there's no point doing 30,000 cuts when I could just cut it off with the saw so all I've got to do now is face one end spin them round set a jig up so they go back and machine them down to about 80 mil somewhere around there and then we can weld that, that bit on, on the top. And then they should be ready to go onto the pony truck, which we still have to amend. And we also have to do some slight modifications to the bearings. But we'll come to that in a bit. I've set up the mill, we're ready to roll. So back to cutting.
1.7 to take off. I think I'm just sticking out a bit too much so it's vibrating a bit. Well I am taking I am taking quite a big cut though. Perfect. I think on the next one what I'll do is I'll do two passes. Two hours later. Right, so I'm just setting up because I want to put an M6 thread in the end of that 12mm bar. So I'm just setting it up to find the centre. Right, so I've gone in half an inch. Should be enough. If you like this video, then you may like the video down here. And this link up here takes you to our channel, where we have many, many more videos. Don't we, Bridget? Stay safe. Laters.